Hello, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And I'm back with a new look with a new brand that I've never tried before. So I'm excited to be trying this out. And um, I went ahead and started with um, Aldi Bit of Goody. Now an Aldi Bit of Goody. The Super Goop uh, Glow Oil with a SPF 50 in there. And then what I did go ahead and use today for my foundation is I used the very last of my LYS. It's just, yeah, it's gone. And uh, I have uh, 3N, or Light Neutral 3, LN3. And I have the <clears throat> same shade in the concealer, and I have this on as well today. And so, yeah, these are both just really good products and I've used this one completely up and this one is pretty new so I've got at least three quarters left of it yeah so uh, that's what I'm wearing there and it gives you a really glowy kind of base here and then as far as what I did for blush today I started with the face off blush by um, Hard Candy and this one is in sparks fly and so it's a really pretty kind of corally color here we'll do a swatch here so yeah it's kind of scary when at first there's a lot of pigment there but if you just go ahead and blend out then it blends into a really pretty flush on the cheeks and i went ahead and added the color pop let's dance on top of that so um, as far as the blush, I have these two on there. And then as far as the highlighter, the Revlon um, Daybreak and 201. And yeah, the packaging's all messed up, but I really like the product. So yeah, that's what I have there. Um, as far as my bronzer today, um, I did go ahead and pull out my Lumi bronzer. This is the one in light. And so it's really a golden kind of brown, and it does um, have some sparkles in it, so it does give you some radiance. Really pretty there. And then as far as the new products that I have, um, like I said, it's a new palette to me, new brand. I've never tried it before. Uh, the Nomad, and they were having a sale, and I picked up Cartagena which is and it's Cartagena Magica um this one isn't that in Spain I'm pretty sure that's in Spain um but this palette is really pretty really summery kind of palette um very feminine kind of palette uh as far as the way it's set up it looks like it's set up so that you would go ahead and use each row as a color I mean, you can mix and match anything you want, but it's really set up that it looks like each row is going to be its own its own kind of look. And um, I started today with this one in my crease. And then, let's see, I did this one on the inner corner, this uh, yellow right there. Um, I went ahead and did this one on the lid, and then this one on the lid, and... Um, Oh, I went ahead and put this one uh, right above this one, so yeah. And then I did a little bit of this right under the brow. And so I tried to use as many colors as you know I could for this look. And again, I just think it's really pretty. The formula is really blendable and easy to work with. The pigmentation is a little bit different um, from like what I saw in the pan, I found that things, um, that their mattes were a little bit more pigmented and their, um, so this shade looked a little darker when it went on me. Um, but the, uh, the really pretty, um, is shimmers and metal metallics had a little less, uh, pigment. And so, yeah, it's uh, it's a very fun palette, a very fun summer palette. Um, like I said, I haven't tried it before. I know it's a huge brand and that people love it. And so, yeah, if you want to pick up a summer palette, I would definitely say that this one will go ahead and work for you. It's, it's fun. I like it. And um, 
just uh, what I went ahead and paired with it was a ColourPop just a tint. This one is in uh, City of Stars, so this is the way that this looks. And then this way, um, the, the So Glassy that I went ahead and used, or looks. Yeah, looks. Here's the way that the lips look, and then the way that the um, eyeshadow came out. So I just went ahead and used the eyeshadow. I didn't use any eyeliner or anything with it, and I think it gave a really a really pretty summer look, a really peachy, peachy, glowy kind of summer look is what I'm trying to say there. And then as far as the rest of it, it's going to be the usual suspects. Uh, the NYX Thick It Stick It in Cool Ash Brown. And uh, let's see, the Essence Volume Stylist and the Sky High by Maybelline. So I went ahead and mixed both of these mascaras. And they usually work real, really well for me. Once in a while, I'll have a smear or something, but not at all like some formulas. And I just attribute it to the fact that I'm using two different formulas, and so I just kind of keep an eye on it, and it really hasn't caused a problem or caused me to have panda eye or anything. So, um, yeah, that's what I have there. And uh, this packaging is just so beautiful. Okay, yeah, yeah, it's definitely really pretty high quality palette there and I'm so glad I found that sale and that I got to go ahead and try this and um, let's see I think that's just about the whole video so <laughs> I hope that you have a great day bye